Ricky, this is Ray Pacino, the man keeping your Irish friends in liquor. I thought I was doing that. I hear you need work. I want to throw your bone, Nicky. Come over to Drusilla's in Little Italy. We'll have a little sit down. I got a favor to ask you. What is it? Well, you've been spending time with the rest of my family. I figured you may as well complete the set. You remember my brother Derek? Came along on the bank job? Sure. He's in a bad way. Last I heard, he was spending his hours in some park in Athens. Go down and check on him. Me and Gerald will cover any expenses incurred. All right, man. I'll go find him. Oh, man. Thing. We'll be there. Here we are. Great, thanks. You fucking pump. I'll be back for you. Yes, here's my man, Nico. Hey, Jacob.
Yo, nigga, some serious firepower up in here. Rocket launcher, boom! Let's find him and get this over with. I don't like being in this man's pocket. Yeah, not but bada bada. Chopper. Stick to him, Nico. We need to take him down there with no people. For a man who has asked me to kill a lot of men, this guy is really safety conscious. Say, we got that government thing about it. I feel it great a good and thing. I have the feeling he don't want to be responsible for a helicopter crash in Middle Park. Show that. Yo, this be some crazy shit in a Nico. Yo, we on the star trucks in a helicopter. Some real spy shit I know is doing it up. Shows you that the people who need spy shit done get other people to do their dirty work. Same bridge and everything crash. Shit, Jacob. You really gotta smoke that thing now? The secondary smoke doesn't exactly help my hand-eye coordination. And I'm paranoid enough with U.S. government on my ass. Whatever. Actually, just smoke it. You know, sight the man soon, see? We shut down that chopper for you. I don't know that. You think I've been sitting around scratching my balls with my head up my ass? I'd be impressed if you had been. I appreciate your assistance. You did a good thing to me. Now it's my turn. I will try to find the man you're after. I will call when I have some.
the table for one? We got a beautiful bacala saddle. I'm here for someone. I'm here for Ray. Oh, Ray, why did you say so? Ray's a beautiful man, you know what I mean? Uh, he's in the back. Thanks. Hey, Nikki! Ha <laughs> ha! How you doing, kid? Fine. Ah, <laughs> hey! <laughs> that Mick bastard friend of yours says you're okay. Good. That you're reliable. Yep. But can I trust you? Hmm? Why go through all this? Why stick your neck out? Why do all this work? Because I need the money. And because I can't do anything else. And because I'm good at it. Sure. And because I'm trying to find someone. Okay, maybe we can help. See how we do. So anyways, I got this friend. Only the friend ain't my friend no more because he ain't getting me the vigios. Okay. Seems this guy does not respect the waste management business. Lives over in a project on Galveston near you. Name is Teddy Benavidez. Do what you gotta do. Somebody gets burnt, so be it. Fine. And you'll pay. Hey, you kidding? I'll pay double. Good. But, you mess up, bad things are gonna happen. You know what apartment Teddy Benavides is in? No sé, I don't know no Teddy's. You sure about that? You want the last thing to come out of your mouth to be a lie? on the top floor, apartment 151K. You have to walk the last few floors. Elevator don't go up there. They're fixing it up. Dog, someone's coming up. Don't know how, but he knows where your apartment is. There he is. Over there. 
there's an asshole. Slow, my mouth. Uh. I'm not gonna go. I'm your brother. I'm supposed to take care of my family. Hey! I'm beyond being taken care of now. Hey! 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 
Your brother said you needed a hand. <laughs> Looks like you need more than that. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Oh. <sighs> hey! Ah! Wake up, you fucking junkie! I'm awake. I was just wishing you'd leave. Hey! Hey! Sit down. <laughs> That's pretty good gear. I'm pretty high. Good for you. Okay. Don't get sanctimonious on me. Okay. Why do you do this to yourself? Because it feels nice. <clears throat> because it feels better to be high than not. Does it stop you thinking? <coughs> it stops you caring. Which is even better. <coughs> so. What do you care about? I care about getting people back who claimed I was a grass. People who used that to steal shit off me. Huh. Maybe that's what your brother was talking about. When they said you needed help taking care of all the business. Sure. I mean... <clears throat> I ain't a saint. I ain't a man of principle. I... I messed up. But... I tried. I made a mistake! But I admitted it. We all make mistakes. Exactly! And this guy is still threatening to kill me and my family! What's his name? Uh, uh. Bucky Sligo. Bucky Sligo. I heard he was living in Alderney. Can you get access to police computer? Sure. Find the fuck. Shut him and his pals up. Ugh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, his pals up. Calculating route. Please make a U-turn where safe. In 800 yards. Hey, Derek. Apparently, your guy hangs out at the burger shop in the Alderney. Go check it out. But make sure his boys are there. I want them all to pay. What if he's alone? Keep the police call. He'll see you and think you're taking him down. First thing Bucky will do is run back to his crew. Fucking coward! He'd rather everyone go down than him take a ball alone. Sold me out, didn't he? I guess he did, man. I'll tell you when it's done. Bad muncher! Ah. Oh, Easy joker! Ah. Run to your friends, Bucky. The cops are here.
Fantastic! My boy, good to hear your voice. To speak to you, I mean. Derek, you okay? Bucky and this boys are dead. What? Sorry, not off for a second. Bucky dead? That's good. Yeah, alive, but dead. It's all the same, though, isn't it? Living, dead, good, bad, right, wrong, chalk, cheese. I'll speak. Back among the living. In 100 yards, turn left. Turn left. In 200 yards, turn right. Take a seat. Thank you. So, you took care of that thing? Yes. I appreciate that. Hey, no, nope. I look after my friends. I got a lot of friends. Important friends. Jimmy Pegarino is a personal friend of mine. More or less. <coughs> hey, sweetheart. Hey. My God, you look like shit. What's wrong? Nothing. I haven't been to bed yet. I've been smoking crystal. You've been what? <coughs> what are you, a fucking idiot? white trash motherfucker, what is wrong with you? Give me a break, okay? I feel like death. Hey, hey, hey! What? It's because I care. You know that. Yeah, I know that. Now, speaking of the ice. Yeah, they got it. They, they left it where you said. That's why I came over here. Can I get a goddamn coffee yeah, here? Yeah, you look like you could really use some goddamn caffeine. I'm fucking coming down, asshole. I feel like death. Fine, whatever. Uh, Nico, need you to go collect some garbage for me. Garbage? Yeah, you wanted a career in waste disposal, now you got one. 
Can I get a goddamn coffee over uh, here? What kind of garbage? Garbage with a lot of ice in it. Today? Go over to F between Columbus and Denver. There'll be a truck waiting there. Three guys. Good guys. Friends of mine. Main guy's name is Luca. Go. Okay. <coughs> hey, sugar. <coughs> Come here. All oh, this'll be over soon. You gotta stop me smoking this stuff, Ray. I'm fucking killing myself. Luca? Yeah, you Nico? This is Tuna Fish and Johnny Spaz. Tuna, Johnny, Nico. Hey. So, we're all friends now. All right, Tuna, John Boy, you got the threads. Get in the back and get the trash. Come on, let's go. Nico, here's your gear. You're driving. That cool? Let's roll. First pickups in Chinatown. Let's head it. So someone's been throwing out the load of diamonds? You could say that. Ray got that tweaker chick of his, the biker broad. You met her? Yeah, she's pretty strung out. Ray got her to get her friends to steal the ice off of some club owner guy. Her friends are the lost biker gang. I think I worked with a member of that gang up on Bohan. He was called Johnny or uh, something. Tuna, this is it. Grab the bag. Open up the bag, will ya? Let's go! Next one's on 8th Street. Move out, Nikki. Bikers get so fucked or met that they threw the ice away? Nah, it seems this club owner's got more connections than a subway line. He's in with the Ancelotti's, the Dominicans up in Northwood, everybody. Ray came up with this plan to keep a bit of distance between us and the robbery. The bikers is taking the heat for this shit. This ain't the easiest way to pick this shit up. Even if we don't want to attract any attention. Yeah, me and Tuna were saying that before you got here. We were saying that there's a lot of opportunities for this to go wrong. The bank could split, the diamonds could go missing real easy. That's why we're going to be extra careful, right? We wouldn't want that to happen, would we? Of course not. You know how pissed Ray would get if he found out some diamonds were missing? He has a temper? Are you fucking kidding me? The manager of one of his waste depots was holding out on profits a couple years back. Ray fed him to a dump truck. There was this point where the sounds of his screams stopped, and all you could hear was his bones crushing. Then the... This is the other one, Tuna. Grab it. We got company. Crap! Someone's got wise to us. Let's get the hell out of here. Drive to Fish Market South. This truck is not really going to outrun anybody, is it? You're just gonna have to do your best, ain't you? We're not losing this ice. I'm not having Ray cut my balls off because you don't think this truck's fast enough. I didn't say it was impossible. It's just going to be difficult. That mook ain't gonna be following us no more. Let's get the ice back. You done good, Nikki.
This is it. You got us here, Nikki. Good driving, Nikki. I thought I was gonna be checking out for sure. How'd they find us? I thought that we went to all this trouble so no one would know. I don't know. These diamonds are serious. Anyone who heard of them would want them. I ain't surprised we get a bit of attention. You want me to take the ice to Raiden? Nah, me and Tony will look after them. Sort them out from the trash. I sure hope we ain't lost any on the route. Things got shaken up pretty good back there. They sure did, Luca. Here's hoping we can find them all. See you around, Nikki. Hey, Cab! Where you wanna go, Hefe? I want to go. this city better than me. Great, thanks. I have bought us a present. You bought it or I did? Nico, I'm offended. I've got us an apartment in Algonquin. What did I say when you got here? Penthouse. Model on each arm. And you have paid for this place? It wasn't so long ago that your debts got you kidnapped by the Russian mob. That was a cold streak. Now I'm hot, cousin. Hotter than the models will be bedding. I can't lose! Roman, we have spoken about your gambling. Wait until you see the new place, NB. You will change your song. So what? I took on a little debt. Mister! Forgive me, but I need this. I'll kill you, motherfucker! Wait Take me to Rand. Finish. I'm going home to blow some haze and beat up the coochie. He don't want you to give it back to him, does he? Shit, no, that's cool. I was just telling him how, you know, you can make things happen. He's gonna be in touch with you about some cars he needs found, if you catch my meaning. Sure, I have an ability to find stuff, if the price is right. Give him my number. Fuck, man, you are the boy. I'll call Stevie. Charge of her, won't you, Nico? They're out at sea. This is the place. It's brought the Korean contact of mine into the country with a boat load of fake hundred dollar bills. As long as the ones he's paying us with are real, it doesn't matter. I owe you an apology, Nico. 
I was dosed when you told me you killed Bucky and his boys. Yeah, you were out of it. I haven't felt safe since Aiden O'Malley went inside. Who's Aiden? Me, Bucky, and Aiden, we all cared about the same stuff. We came together for a cause we believed in. At least, I thought I believed in it. I was young. This was a while ago then. Yeah, so Aiden got caught with something when he was somewhere he wasn't meant to be. Needless to say, he'll be inside for a time. Him and Bucky think I talk. Couldn't see no other way how he got caught. From what I hear, Aiden still rants about me to anyone who listens. I You Parks boy? Yes, I Kim. You Dedeka? Yeah, welcome to America. We're meeting your friends in Bohan. I'll text you the route you gotta take. Best way to avoid checks. We'll cover your rear. Another immigrant. Arriving in this city. Trying to make something of himself. Brings a tear to my eye. When this is done, I won't have to leech off my brothers no more. This deal should mean I can take care of myself. Providing it goes to plan. What the fuck is this? Think I got a clue? Use our boat to shield him from these fuckers. I don't give a shit if this thing sinks. We gotta protect him. I'd rather swim home tonight than come back tomorrow to die for those notes. Got him here in one piece. That was a deal. Thanks, Nico. Thank you, Mr. McGarry. Not such a smooth journey. Yeah, got a bit hairy out there. Good thing you have your sea legs. I hope the rest of your time here is more peaceful. That's all you can hope for in this godforsaken world. See you around, Nico. Don't put all the payoff up your arm, Derek. Only place for it, me boy. Only place for it. See you soon. Hey, 
where you going, man? Take me to Denver Avenue. Sorry, man. This is the close I can get you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, Phil. Sure. Hey, Phil. Listen. You know me, and I know you. Nah, I didn't mean nothing by it. Hey, take it easy. Oh, Phil, take it easy. And hey, listen, tell Jimmy I said hello. Okay. I'm sorry. Goodbye. We got a problem. Who? You and me? Yeah. I got two options. Option one, you rip me off. Option two, Luca and his buddies ripped this bolt off. Hey, hey! I left them with the stuff to bring to you as instructed. Maybe you're in on it. Maybe I am. But if you thought that, I wouldn't be standing here right now. You ain't as dumb as you look. <laughs> Luca hangs out in Castle Gardens. Go see him. Go get my stuff back so everyone can get paid. Now. Right. Hey, Here we are. Thank you very much. Luca, I need that ice back. I don't know what you're talking about, Nikki. I gave every one of those diamonds to Ray. Now, we all know that that's not true. Fuck you, you cabbage-eating prick. Who says it weren't you that made off with them? That's what I'm telling Ray. The game's up, boys. We're out of here. Take me to get. Then here we go. Thanks. Ventura's baby.
you're dead, friend! You're going to die, friend! I will knock both of you out! Run for your lives! I'm going to find you, Luca! Having fun! With me! Luca! Come out! You can have tuna and Johnny's cut! Come on! I told you not to mess with me! I can't! Oh. Okay then! I took out Luca's crew and I got your diamonds. I wanted you to get the ice back. I didn't say nothing to you about killing those boys. Whatever. They're dead, and I've got the stuff. You want to get your hands on it? Come meet me at the bridge in Middle Park. Take one of them. Gracias for your business. Thank you. Put this dog in your mouth. So we need to... Good as gold. That's uh, very kind of you. Thanks, Nicky. I guess you never know who's gonna stab you in the back, huh? Thanks for the advice. Take me to Vetulo Avenue. Here we are. Thank you very much. All right, boy? Yes. Good. How do you do it? I went into a situation full of optimism, full of naivete. I got burnt. Look at me. Like smack on a fucking spoon. Well... How do you manage? I don't know that I got off so lightly. <sighs> we all got our demons. Aiden O'Malley. What about Aiden O'Malley? I heard he's being moved. <sighs> Maybe this is our time. Put all scrap to bed. Get off the drugs. Live with the memories. Hayden's being moved by Van from the bacon factory. He's been talking shit about me. Back to the Albany State Correctional Facility. Please, Nico, boy. Just this last one. Please. Sure, Derek. You... And me, we're the same. The same. The, the same. We're the same, you and me.
Vico, I hear my brother Derek is asking you to ice his old drinking buddy Aiden O'Malley. Yeah, he has. What's the big deal? O'Malley is in government custody. He's got more police protection than the mayor. I left a truck with a rocket launcher in it for you in an alley off of Applewhite in Alderney City. A truck with a rocket launcher in it? What am I meant to do with him? Who knows? Anyway, the convoy with O'Malley in it has to go through the booth tunnel. You're gonna get there first and block the road with your truck. I'm gonna come in from the rear and block him that way. Pick up the truck and give me a call. Make a U-turn. So we're going to... Okay, okay, yet problem. When we have him blocked in, we take down the escort and make off with the prisoner. Why don't we just kill the fucker there and then? That's probably what Derek would have told you to do in his smacked out state. Problem is, he's the first one they'd talk to if that happened. We gotta make this look like a prison break. Great! They're leaving the old cop shop now. Should be at the booth tunnel soon. Calculating route. Please proceed to the highlighted route. I'm in position, Pecky. All right, man, we're coming to you. Take out the escort, but keep Derek's pal alive. What's this jerk think he's doing? Hey, Mitch, can you find out what this guy's up to? Nico, we don't want anyone after us while we're doing what we gotta do. Alright, alright, I'll try to lose these fucking cops.
Okay, man. First thing we got to do is dump this prison van. Cops will be looking. Okay, there's a car. You're not free yet, asshole. Get in that car. All right, Nico. Now that we lost him, we gotta go out to the cliffs and leftward. The cliffs of leftward, then. Is there a boat coming or something? Where am I going? You're going to a faraway place, my friend. Damn right! Somewhere the cops will never find me. Nobody's gonna find you where you're going, friend. Shit! I don't even know who sent you guys. Who do I got to thank for springing me from the joint? We're doing this on behalf of an old acquaintance of yours. I knew I wasn't forgotten about. I knew that no matter how long I rotted in there, people on the outside world still remember me. People remember you, all right. You're at the front of certain people's minds. Well, who is it? Not Julia. She stopped writing and coming on visiting days, but I could tell she was still thinking of me. I knew it. You'll find out who it was when we get there. In the meantime, shut the hell up, buddy. All right, Finn. Thank you.
Out you come, old boy. The cliffs, the sea air. I really am free. I could cry. You've made me a happy man, boys. Now it's time to tell me who asked you to do this. Derek McCreary. He's my brother. Derek? But he ratted me out. He's the reason I ended up in that place to start with, the spineless... So you thought you'd talk about him? He's my brother, and guys like you are killing him. Nico, get ready, dear old Aiden. Aiden is dead. That's the end of a chapter. I can close the book on a whole lot of my past now, Nico. Thanks. Maybe a clean break is in order. A fresh beginning. Good luck to you. May Poseidon swallow you whole. Yo, money. Don't be trifling with me. You made a decision. You're gonna fix this Dwayne problem of ours, yeah? Hey, it ain't our problem, playboy. It's yours. That said, I know what I'm going to do. That right. You cold, Nico. Peace and love. Sit back and I enjoy want to the go ride. To... I smell, I just laid some gas in here. Ew, Playboy X. Yo, Whitey's back. Yo, what you doing? You got rid of Dwayne already? I thought the old dog would have put up more of a fight. <laughs> I didn't kill Dwayne. Well, what you doing back here, then? Step to it, motherfucker. Well, I was thinking that maybe Dwayne is not the problem. Maybe it's you. Motherfucker! You think you can touch this shit? You think I got here by letting little bitches like you fuck with me? I own you! Nobody owns me! I'm screwing around, don't get up! Stay right there, and shut up. Another motherfucker gone and let the money go to his head. Where are you going, playboy?
Even if you kill me, you're gonna have this whole town after your ass. X marks the spot. Get this motherfucker. Dwayne, I dealt with Playboy. You should know that he asked me to end you first. He was going to pay me a lot of money to do it. Shit, man. He was a good kid back in the day. Always hungry, though. Always wanted more. Maybe I should have seen it then. Kept a closer eye on him. You can't predict what people will become. You're right. I can't give you no money for helping me, son. But I got the deed to Playboy's fancy silk chic loft. You can have it. Hey, man, I seen where you're living. You should take it. Nah. It'll make me remember the kid too much. Maybe he'll stop by my place sometime, though. Hang out with me. I don't have many friends left, you know. I'll give you a call sometime soon, Dwayne. Later on. Stop! Now! We're, We're going to... I'll take the long way. Thanks. No one's here. Just you and me. Come in, come in. Beer? No, thank you. Oh, I agree. Let's have whiskey instead. Packy swears by you. Absolutely swears by you. Yeah? <sighs> you handled yourself well on the bank job. It was fun. Fun? Too much fun. That's always been this family's problem. Fun. Good causes, a good laugh, some stupid dream or some stupid distraction. <laughs> but never any fucking focus. Never. Hmm. Focus. <sighs> All we've ever been is bitches, working for guineas, working for niggas, any asshole with a buck, a whole lot spent in a proper manner, oh yeah, wine and women as quick as possible, and remain a slave forever. Very poetical. Yeah, I know. National tragedy. But I got a plan. You down friend. Maybe. What is it? Well, first up, we gotta create a little problem between the Ancelotti's and their Albanian muscle for Jimmy P. You're gonna plant a bomb in Tony Black's car. Be rigged to a phone. Thing will go off when you dial a number. I want it to blow when they get back from their meeting. So the Ancelotti's think the Albanians did it. Exactly. Bombs in an alley off of Inchin Avenue. Get it? Give me a call. You know, Packy was right for once. I'm glad you're on board. Make a U turn. Where can I take We're you? going to Inch on Avenue. Go. Here we are. Oh, thank you. So, Jerry, I got this bomb. All right, listen. The Ancelotti's and the Albanians are meeting in Little Italy. Tony's car is parked in an alleyway off of Feldspar Street. They put the bomb in the trunk, then follow the wise guys from their meeting back to the rest of their crew, then you blow the bomb. Make sure no one walks away. It's easy, right? So easy, I don't see why you ain't doing this yourself. Nico, I wouldn't trust myself with this task. You ain't got a gallon of whiskey in your system, and besides, you're being paid, ain't you? Call me when it's done. Get my son. 
I want to go to Feldspass. Hey, uh, don't play with the windows. Great, thanks. Benny's know they got us over a barrel, Sal. At least it's better than dealing with those fucking drunken Irish bastards, though. Forget about it.
Jerry, I hit the Ancelotti's crew real hard. Everyone got taken down. The rest of them should think the Albanian muscle is making a play. Yeah, I knew my brother wouldn't put his faith in a bum. They'll be at them elbows in no time. That's step one of the plan's complete. Come see me. We'll talk about step two. Nothing to say to you. I nearly ran into your cousin the other day. My friends were uh, hanging. Nothing to say to you. I nearly ran into your cousin the other day. My friends were uh, hanging out with him. The party got busted up though before I got there. I wish you had been there. We could have had some fun. Not as much fun as I would have had with Roman. Baby, I'll be there in a little bit. All right, listen, why don't you wear that pink thing, huh? Yeah, yeah, the pink thing with the little feathers on the, uh... Yeah. I gotta go, I gotta go. Nico, come on in. Okay. Where the fuck have you been? Sorry, you know how it is. I know how it is. Yeah, I know how it is sitting around with two million dollars worth of stolen ice waiting to get jumped, if that's what you mean, brains. Were you followed? No. 
I mean, I don't think so. This town's full of rats, so who knows? What's going on? What's so urgent? I need you to offload this ice for me. So what you going to do for me? What do you mean, what am I going to do for you? I look after you. I don't need looking after. I need help finding someone. I said I got connections. I'll see what I can do. I'll see what I can do is not good enough. I want your word that you'll find him. Hey, I said I'll look after you. Hey, you know what? It's cool. Get someone else. I'll see you later. Oh, whoa, whoa. Are you fucking kidding me? No! no I keep doing these favors for you, and you pay shit. No, I need this from you. I guarantee that you will find this man. I know he's in the city. So either you give me your word or go fuck yourself. I'm sick of this shit. Fine. Fine, you got it. You want my word? You got my word. Good. Who is he? Florian Kravich. <laughs> Florian fucking Kravich? That's right. <laughs> okay. Okay, you have my word. In the meantime, head over to the Libertonian. There you're gonna meet that guy named Johnny, and the two of you are gonna exchange the diamonds with a guy named Isaac. Then, you give Johnny half the money, the rest you bring back to me. What's he doing there? He's waiting to get paid. It'll be good. Keep things on a level. People always behave better with company. Sure. Much better getting shot by two guys than one. Is this the merchandise? No, it's my lunch. Funny. All right, man. How's it going? Hey, good to see you again. Yeah, likewise. Uh, let's hope this goes a little better than before, yeah? Come on, let's get inside. Gentlemen, gentlemen, pardon the precautions. You know how things are. No problem. Let's do this. Okay, let's see the stuff, gentlemen. Maury, come over here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Since we're having a little show and tell, let's see some money. Of course, no problem. There it is. Beautiful, huh? Unmarked bills. No history, no need to launder. Good. Nico, show him the stuff. Get in there, Maury. Isaac, look at them. Gorgeous, huh? Like condensed money. Isaac, these are great. Rest of you motherfuckers want to die? Do something stupid, okay? Fuck you! Just get the shit, man! Come on!
So can you take We'll be there in no time. Thank you very much.
You sure this guy's alright? I'm telling all right? you, the guy's You good. checked him out? Hey, here he is right here. Phil Nico. Nico Phil. So you're the guy who got jumped for a couple of million? Yeah. You gonna pop me for it? <laughs> no, I've heard good things. Some odd friends, but you know, what are you gonna do? You're right. I've been keeping bad company. Oh, you mean this guy? He's okay. Well, he pays up, and uh, he ain't gone stage yet. Very funny, ha ha. Listen, we got a lot of missing money, and we got a problem with these fucking bikers. And I've got the problem finding someone. Yeah, I nearly got something on that. So we sent some of our boys after the money. Maybe you can deal with the bikers. Calm them down. They're causing trouble on the corner of Vauxite and Exit. Sure. Otherwise, you and Raymond here got a serious problem. The boss has got to get paid. Even when people forget to tell them about things they're working on. I right, don't bust my balls. What's the point of talking about things unless they become real? I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure you're sure, Phil. You of all people. Now, what the hell does that mean? Nothing. I mean, come on. You're a yeah, guy who yeah, knows what's yeah, what, yeah, right, yeah, Phil? Yeah, Take okay. it easy. Yo! So can you take me to Vo- I can't get any closer than this, so I have to drop you off right here. Come on, you don't fuck with me. Come on, tough guy, get out of the car. You took something that belonged to my employers. Shit! That's the cocksucker that Johnny ripped off for the diamond loot. Hey, why don't we see if he can keep up with some real American bikers? Hey, let's do this! Could they make this easy?
10 yards. Turn left. Sorry. Sophisticated European. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> so, how are you? All right, yeah. Cage, don't stand there talking to him on the doorstep. Ask him in. Oh, come in. Ma, you remember the boy's friend Nico? How are you? Good, and you? Put it like this. My boys are out of control. My daughter can't find a man. And my husband is in hell. I'm thinking... God moves in mysterious ways. Oh, that's mother for you. Always a joy. <laughs> <laughs> Nico! You made it, uh, huh? Well, I'll leave you to your men's talk. I hope you impress each other. Hey, look at me. Yeah. Yeah. I thought so. You'll do fine. Fine at what? Some gimp work for the Pegarinos. I owed him. Oh, please. I do it myself, but I think I'm being watched by the cops. Someone. I think I'm about to get pinched again. Shit, really? Yeah, it's happened before. I keep seeing the same car watching. All it means is someone's been speaking, we just have to find out who and make them stop. In the meantime, it chill things out for a bit. So, I need your help. Okay. Atta boy. Come on, I got something to show you. Now, Pegorino's a funny guy. Seems like his main motivation is putting his Guernsey crew on par with the five old families. Ancelotti's being the weakest. He's decided to stir shit up for him. Now, the Ancelotti's have an uneasy alliance with some Albanians. They use them as hitmen, thugs, bullies. I know the type. Much like Jimmy DeGuido uses us. So, what you're gonna do is disguise yourself as an Albanian and then go whack Frankie Garone. An Ancelotti long-time capo. Sure. Which Albanian? Uh... This one.
Tony Black didn't do nothing to nobody who didn't deserve it. What the fuck? We're going to the mattresses for sure. Frankie Garone sleeping with the fishes. Anyone who saw us is going to describe the Albanian you got on ice. Nice work. Really nice. I'll let Jimmy P know about that. I'll cut you in on anything he throws my way. I don't know how long I'm gonna be outside, though. I feel like the cops might knock down my door any moment. Good luck with that, Jerry. Listen to me, Isaac. Listen, dick. It's not my fault you got robbed. Not my fault. I had nothing to do with it. Nothing. You understand? I'm on a cell phone, you jerk. Oh, you want me killed? Oh, yeah? Screw you! I'm done with you. You understand? I'm finished. No, no, you know what? I ain't even started yet, you demon fuck! I'm in shit because of you, you piece of sh Hello? Hello? Uh, ah! Go ahead! Open your mouth, asshole! Push your fucking luck! Ray! What the fuck do you want? You told me to come. Well, sorry! Having a bad fucking day! Oh, I'm sorry. Me too. Fuck it. Fuck it. That curly head. Leech is gonna talk! Go shut that stooge up! Shut who up? Isaac! The diamond dealer! He's blaming me for everything! Everything! Even the shit we didn't do. Now I got no money, no diamonds, and his dick's threatening to have me killed. Blaming me, cause he got robbed. Okay, so? He's holed up in the Majestic with a couple of his cronies. Go shut those fuckers up. No problem. Hey, can I get a coffee, please?
This area is off limits, buddy. We got a problem here. There ain't no Have you the you Son of a bitch. I got you now, you son. Take the cover. Fuck you want? <laughs> Screw you. We got you. Son. One more! Take some fucking cover! Hey, be a friend! Don't worry, friend. Everything's gonna be okay! Trouble, you crazy scumbags! You wouldn't listen! I shut Isaac up for you. I feel like all I've been doing is shutting people up ever since this diamond thing started. Well, we ain't got the diamonds, and we don't know where they are. Johnny, that biker scumbag has disappeared with the money. And every other mouth that came close to those diamonds is closed for good. Except for yours, that is. You gotta be grateful for that. Screw you, Ray. I ain't your cleanup guy no more. You get that? All right, Nikki, all right. Don't go forgetting about respect or nothing. You're still just another straight-off-the-boat punk. It can get real scary if you don't got friends. You remember that. Taxi. 
So where Take to? Take me to Castle Dry. Here we are, then. Why didn't you tell me Derek was back? What? Why didn't you tell me you was hanging around with my brother? I assumed if you cared, you'd have found out. Well, I have found out. Jesus, you know Derek's not well. No? No, he's sick. He always was. He's always off getting involved in someone else's fight, making a fool of himself, betraying people, going into hiding. He's an idiot and a coward. It's not my business. Whatever he stood for, he betrayed. He only left here in the first place because he was caught stealing from the Mafia. He's a pathetic wretch. Okay, I got it, so... Now, he's gonna ruin my life. If it wasn't bad enough having a bunch of crooks for brothers, now I've got him threatening to talk to a journalist about his family, about me! Well, tell him to be quiet. I am trying to become the commissioner of police. I'd be a laughing stock. A cop with the famous snitching traitor for a brother. Ugh. You know, the crooks I can handle. See, that I can spin. But not this, not this. Uh, you got the big problem then. Me? Uh -uh. We, my friend, we. You stop it. <coughs> stop? St stop. Kill your brother. He's already dead. Just put him out of his misery. Fuck you. No, fuck you, pal. I'm gonna meet him in the courtyard park off Bismarck and Lancet. Deal with him. Make him a tragedy, not a disaster. Do it, or I will put you away. Oh, don't push me. Nico, thank fuck you, Ant. Frankie arranged to meet me at this park on Bismarck. I think he's gonna try to kill me. Cops can kill who they like. Do you know the place? Are you close? Can you get there in time? I think I can make the meeting. You gotta take him out before he makes a move. This is Cain and Abel stuff, I'm telling you. Question is, which one of us is gonna be wandering the earth with a mark on his head, and who's gonna be six feet under, you know? This phone's running out of battery, shit! Look after me, Nico. Where can I take you? We're going to Bismarck Inn. The fascists won't let me drive there, but I can let you off nearby if that's okay. Francis, I'm ready. What is the plan? I hope you got over yourself and are ready for some fratricide. Don't forget that I still got dirt on you. I know this ain't nice, but neither of us has a choice. It's sounding like I got no choice. One McCreary brother is going to get me to kill another. That's what I like to hear. I want you to take the window cleaning elevator on one of the buildings around back of the courtyard. Get in position and put Derek out of his misery. Shit, I better get ready to act surprised. Don't miss, Nico. You might hit me. I'll hit who I'm aiming at. Don't worry. Derek, my brother! Frankie, what's this about? I've got to say, I'm nervous about this little meeting. Shit, when I heard you was back, I nearly shot myself. Sit down. Why didn't you call me? You could have slept on my couch. I'm doing real well for myself, real well. I'm sorry about how life turned out for you.
bolt of lightning from out of the fucking blue. I really got the feeling it was him and me back there. You don't know the half. This is the last bit of juice I got on this thing. Where are you going, man? Vamos, let's go! To Albany Avenue. Here. Here we are. It's a wrap. One last cop on the streets of Liberty City. What do you mean, Packy? I mean that my cop brother Francis McCreary is no longer with us. You and Jerry must be very upset. Hardly. Couldn't stand the bastard myself. That said, the only celebrating Jerry's gonna be able to do will be in prison. He got hauled in last night. Shit, is it serious? Charges ain't gonna stick, don't worry. Anyway, it means a lot to the family if you come to Francis' funeral. It's at the church in Suffolk today. I'll stop by, man. I'll see you there. Remember to wear a suit, Nico. Can't have you dressed like a bum in the church. Hi, Nico. Hey, Kate. I am sorry to hear about your brother. You're probably the only one. He was too much of a cop for my family to accept him, and too much of a gangster to be accepted by the cops. What did you think about him? To be honest, I thought this would have happened earlier. Then again, I expect to get a call from the coroner about any one of my brothers every day. You going to be at the funeral? Sure. I'll see you there, Kate. Goodbye. Thank you. And while no one is suggesting he was an angel, none of us are. <laughs> that is why God put us on earth and not in heaven. The trials of humanity were sometimes too much for him to bear. But he was a committed family man and a man of beliefs. God asks us to show faith, and that is what he did in his way. Francis gave so much of himself and will be sorely missed by us all. Amen. 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 Now, if you will all please join me in the procession to the cemetery. I'm, uh, sorry for your loss. I'm not. I'm sorry for Ma. I gave up on my brothers a long time ago. The most I ever expected from them was to put flowers on their coffins. Hmm. You have a strange family. Who doesn't? I don't know. Oh my god, get the hell out of the way!
another notch on my gun. <laughs> Having fun? <laughs> Fuck you, McCleary! Nico, it's time to go, but we're taking my brother with us. Can you drive the Romero? Frankie's plot is in the graveyard on Colony Island, Nico. Can we put him in the ground? Damn it, with some back doors light, Nico! The fucking casket better not fall out! Don't look like they're following us no more, thank fuck. Shit, I never thought I'd be on the run from some Albanian gangsters with a cop in the car. Can we call for backup or something? Are you suggesting that I'm a fucking cop? I thought that you would know better than that. No, you dumb European fuck! I met my brother, Francis. It was a joke. Hell of a fucking time to be making jokes about your dead brother. You know, I'm still not that fond of the guy, even in his death. I guess that's what turning cop will do to a fraternal relationship. I guess you've got enough brothers to hate one of them. Swiftly running out, Nico. Ain't got that many left. Now that Francis is on his way to the graveyard and Gerald is behind bars, all I got left is that smackhead Derek. Okay, this is it. We can put him in the ground now. Thanks, Nico. What for? Guys like you don't like cops. Being here, helping us out, I appreciate it. It's not that I don't like cops. You do what you do to get by. Cops are just regular guys trying to survive. Anyway, I'm not here for Francis. I'm here for you and Packy. Like I said, thanks. Give me a call sometime, Nico. You're going to have to buy a new one of these, friend. No me toques, cabrón! Where can I take you? Albany. Way to go. Thanks. Nico, Gerald McCreary here, calling from the Albany State Correctional Facility. Hey, Jerry. I heard you've been locked up. I'm sorry to hear that. We gotta discuss something. Put you on the visitors list here? You come down. <laughs> 